The market basket in Salem, Massachusetts is mourning one of its own employees, a woman who died from the coronavirus. And she wasn't the only confirmed case at the location. And now grocery stores across the state are adding extra measures to try to keep employees and shoppers safe. WBZ's Lisa Greshi has the details. That woman's husband has a message he wants all of us to hear, and that is just how quickly everything changed. He says his wife went into the hospital and lost her battle to COVID-19 before it really even started. They put her on the respirator almost immediately, and she passed away a week later. Vitalina Williams felt sick one day while working at the Salem Market Basket. She left early and was in the hospital two days later. And my last memory of her, seeing her sitting there in her coat and leaving her at the emergency room. I couldn't even stay with her. David Williams didn't think that would be the last time he saw his wife. He didn't get to say goodbye. Outside of the market basket today, a line of customers social distancing. I think they're doing a great job here, but what a tragedy to hear. The state now issuing new guidelines to help stop the spread of the virus in grocery stores. It's about how uh, to provide a safe environment for customers as well as the workforce. This includes limiting the number of people inside at a time to 40% capacity and encouraging customers to use online delivery or curbside pickup options instead. They're taking a risk. Yeah. Well, they have precautions and they're taking precautions for us. So we should consider them. Vitalina's husband, left searching for comfort, knows how many lives she touched. We lost a good one. They all know that. Everybody that knew her knows we lost a good one. Two other employees have tested positive for COVID-19 here. Market Basket says the store has since been deep cleaned and they have counselors here for anyone having a tough time with this devastating loss. Reporting in Salem, Massachusetts, Lisa Greshi, WBC News.